Hi guys, welcome back to another vlog. Why are you laughing? <laughs> Nancy saying that my intro is cliche. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Guys, let me know if it's cliche or not. But anyways, <laughs> we are at the Grand Prairie Stampede, which is a yearly event. We have never been here before. We decided that instead of being a homebody today, which we are, and which we are really feeling like being, we've decided to make the short trip out to Evergreen Park to check out the Grand Prairie Stampede. Now the Grand Prairie Stampede is an annual event that they have um, rodeo, rides, different activities. So we're just gonna be going there right now to see what it's all about. So come along guys, as we check out the Grand Prairie Stampede for the first time. Can I get tickets to buy at the venue? Can I get tickets? Show me life. Show me love, make a change, time is up We can wait for better days, but the days won't come Show me life, show me love Show me life, show me love Make a change, time is up We can wait for better days, but the days won't come Show me life, show me love this is all we got Show me life, show me love This is all we got Show me love, show me love And parking for the middle part of 10 to 15 minutes we have to walk a fair distance back to the main location get some ex um, some steps up there's a place around just ram up man come Malika we're gonna have to walk We don't need no more exercise than this today. No. <laughs> <laughs> this is enough exercise for today. And we're not there yet. Yes, guys, we made it. After walking for 10, 15 minutes, there about. Was it longer than that? I'm not sure I wasn't calculating the time. Uh, where's the entrance to this place? Come through this door. Mm. 
Yeah. I think today's the last, I think tomorrow's the last, I don't even quite remember. It's all right here. What do you want to try, Malika Jade? Malia, what do you want to try? This one? Let's go and get tickets, okay? Let's go and get tickets first. Let's go and get tickets. Yeah, it seems like it's um I don't like the fact that there's not much persons like advising and helping as to what's going on, like organizers. Huh? I'm with them right here. Okay guys, so we're on the first wheel in Malika, we're starting to start moving. Are you, are you excited? telling us that our daughter can't go on the ride and he's allowing two other persons same height to go on the ride. Guys, Malika want to go on this ride, but there's no stop, so we don't trust it. Giant strawberry. <laughs> so, 
we were able to get this form that allows us to bypass the line because Malika has special needs. So I was a little bit frustrated at first because it seemed like there wasn't any provision for people with special needs, but we didn't even have to pay. So, win for Grand Prix. It's gonna go fast, you know, fast or slow. So I said fast, because we are here. You're in a big strawberry. Yes, Marika. So wherever we go, I will find Jamaica and have to talk to them. One of the things that we realize is that mostly Jamaica and upon the, the staff are the stampede. So we chat to them a little. Crap, I understand, man. Yeah, guys, so we meet Chris and Ernie yeah, yeah, here. So you guys, first time coming to Grand Prairie? Second, no, second time. Second, yeah. Oh, you guys were here last year too? Yeah, man. That's it. So tell me now, you guys go all over Canada? All over the place. What do you feel like as a Jamaican being able to like, travel all over a place like that? Why, well, crazy man. It's a good experience. It's a good time. Yeah. You meet a lot of people. Yeah. Right? yeah. Dr. Okay. Chris, they watch the channel before. Yeah, man, watch the channel, guys. And I see me see the guy and the midway, and I said, shit, I don't know where I'm from, but on the channel, we remember, I have to yell him up. You know, that's I it, want love, it. man. We spread that everywhere we go. That's it, that's it. That's it. Yeah, yeah, man. I'm big up learning as well. Yeah, you're learning yeah, 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 what are you doing? I'm going to go to the 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 house. 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 I'm
So now I'm big up my wifey. Why wifey? Wifey that yard see me. Big up wifey man. Big up wifey man. I'm not a pressure no, I'm not a pressure. Yes, guys. So it's the next day. <laughs> just waking up, so tired. I'm uh, just gonna end this video right here. But before I end this video, I want to say, guys, that going to the stampede is a classic example of why you should never judge a book by its cover. Mm -hmm. Definitely. Now, we've been in Grand Prairie for five years, and this is the first time we're going to the Stampede. More so because we had a, a, a expectation in our mind of what it was going to be like. Because when we hear about the Stampede, and we hear about rodeo and stuff like that, we thought that it was kind of kind of like some cowboy stuff. <laughs> and we assumed that we're not going to be interested in stuff like that, so we have never been. But we were home and we decided that, you know what, we're going to go and check it out because one, to do content for you lovely people. And two, just so we can actually see for ourselves what it was like. And guess what, guys? We were pleasantly surprised that it have a vibe. It have a buzz. <laughs> it definitely have a vibe, guys. And to the point that um, today is the last day that it's going to be um, in Grand Prairie. And we're even thinking of going back. <laughs> We're even thinking of going back, guys, to show you how much fun we had, right? After not going there for five years. So this is a classic example of why you should never judge a book by its cover. Hopefully you guys are enjoying that beautiful blue skies behind me. It's now nine o'clock in the morning. The sun is out and it's looking like it's going to be a beautiful day. It's my birthday weekend, guys. So I'm just giving thanks. I'm, I'm so grateful for life. Grateful for health, grateful for family, and grateful for all of you lovely people who always watch our videos, subscribing to our channel, and you know, always leaving a comment on our videos. We really appreciate it. You shout out to all the Jamaicans who I've met yesterday. So, we have met a lot of Jamaicans yesterday working at the Stampede, and this is seasonal employment for a lot of them. And coming from Jamaica, we know how important seasonal employment is for the economy, but also for the families of these people. So if you're seeing this video, we met you yesterday. We want to say welcome to Grand Prairie, even though you guys are just here for a couple of days. Hopefully you guys enjoyed your time in the city. You guys were awesome yesterday. It was such a pleasure meeting you guys. You made it easy for us. Cause I don't know when Jamaicans meet other Jamaicans, it's like we know each other. We grew up together. We go to the same school and we eat out of the same pot. <laughs> so you don't know. Big up on yourself. And see of travels as you guys head to Edmonton. Because this is going to be in Edmonton, I think. And uh, I don't remember the date, but I think it's on the 6th or the 9th of, of June. So if you're in Edmonton, the fear is coming to your town. Go and show some support. It's, go and show some love. And go and meet some Jamaicans as well. Because there's a lot of Jamaicans who are there. And stuff like that. And for other organizers, big up on yourself. Sorry that I misjudged the stampede. <laughs> And we will be there next year. <laughs> you understand? So thank you guys so much for watching this video. I'll see you guys in the next one.